You want to tell me what's going on? Can you back up? This is private property right now. Unless you want me to call the police. Oh no, I'm, I'm, I just want to ask some questions, that's all. That's not what's No going questions? On. You're going to call Wine 1-1? Um, you heard me, sir. I heard you say Wine 1-1. Uh, I talked to the hotel, apparently they're not, they don't like you guys being on the property. Oh, we're not on their property. Hey guys, this is Redress Now, uh, bringing you an early morning audit from uh, Saturday, August the 19th, probably about 2 a.m. Doing this with Auditing Erie County. We are at the uh, Best Western at 601 Dingen Street in the town of Cheektowaga, New York. And this is an interesting audit. We're taking a look at um, National Guard troops that have been dispatched to the hotel uh, after the halting of the arrival of asylum seekers uh, into Erie County after uh, at least two arrests for rape, um, or alleged rape, uh, that apparently has been perpetrated by two migrants. So I uh, wanted to go check this out because it's it's always interesting to me uh, how and why uh, National Guard troops get bootstrapped into these domestic security missions. Um, what comes to mind as a recent example is, uh, you know, the whole 2020 situation where the National Guard got bootstrapped into this uh, you know, role with airport security where you had to show them your papers to show that you were vaccinated or that you didn't have COVID or that, you know, you got tested in your home state and all that crap. Um, seems to always be a backdoor way around uh, politicians being accountable for deploying law enforcement resources to a, to a particular area. To explain what I mean by that, Poland Cars wants the National Guard out here and probably Kathy Hochul does as well because it's not local police, it's not county police. Therefore, if, if anything negative happens in terms of detaining a migrant or dealing with a migrant, etc., cetera, um, it falls back on National Guard leadership, not Mark Polenkars, not Kathy Hochul. Furthermore, as you'll see in the video, uh, I think the hope on the part of local and state politicians is that the National Guard members will be an imposing enough presence to keep independent and mainstream journalists away from the area and stop them from coming into the building. So uh, I'll bring you right to the audit now and uh, go ahead and check things out. How's it going? Who are you? Oh, I'm just a member of the public. I'm just curious as to what's going on here. Um, this is private property. Oh, okay. Right now, you're considered trespassing. We will call 911. Oh, I'm not allowed to come in? No, you're not allowed. This is private property right now. Okay. Could, you want to tell me what's going on? Can you back up? This is private property right now. Unless you want me to call the police. Oh, I'm no. I I'm, I'm, I just want to ask some questions. That's all. That's not what's no going on. No questions? Now. Okay. No but problem. can't answer anything. All right. No problem. Yeah. You do have to leave, though. Okay. I've been informed by the Buffalo Police to call them if anybody's trespassing here. No, we're not trying to trespass. So Just want to ask some questions. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. Thank you. Thank yep. you. You got I, it. I don't want to do that. Yep. The hotel's not No. No, it's a private property. Oh, yeah. Sir. I've been I've been informed it's private property. It's private property. And that, in there. Uh, it's not, they're not, there's no uh, rooms available. Uh, I guess not. Huh. Negative. Uh, uh, negative. Okay, I will contact you right now. You're gonna call Wine One One. Um, you heard me, sir. I heard you say Wine One One. The GSA map says you got about right here is the line where the property starts. I'm on public easement right now. starts and ends we are definitely not in this guy's property yes this 
911 coming up. Five eleven. Come on, man. I'm over six. <laughs> Guys, I want to see that where the property line starts. Where I saw the this. Informed where the property line is. Mm -hmm. Took too long. The police were here. Not too long ago. No, they were. I mean, they weren't here. They were here when I got here. What kind of hijinks were they up to? We just came from the green car stop. There's the food shop. I guess uh, that's the walk of shame because there goes the police. Don't cross the on the walk of shame, guys, because there goes the food. There they go up again. There goes Chicawaga. Why am I loving work around? Hopefully he doesn't call 911 either. Oh, he's got a name tag? Yeah. <clears throat> My guess is he's part of like a... Uh, he probably owns this place. Either that or he's part of a contracting service that uh, places people. You know what I mean? Maybe. He went in there, hey, guys, call 911. They're like, oh, we already did and they're not coming. They kept driving. They <laughs> drove by twice and blinked their light. Oh, this guy's on the phone. Uh-oh. Monkey call and trying to contact Y-11. That's that car where there's soldiers in there. Calvary's here. Let's see if this guy's going to follow him. How the word public easement works. the building. Line one one coming up. We got a GSA map on the scene. Always know your rights and stand on them with confidence. This guy's leaving. My boy in the black and his black shirt. So I have to do the walk of shame. Forty-two, you're in here. Hundred fifty. Let's hit that thumbs up. And we're happy to hit the magical thumbs up. It's free. It helps the algorithm, and it helps uh, people who call nine one one. 
got another got another gang unit rolling up for wine one one. No. What's going on here? Come on now. Another 25 years hit that thumbs up. We got 58 more years to go. Let's smash that thumbs up for your boy Erie County. Let this guy know calling line 1 1 is only going to make it worse for them. Oh shit, we got three police vehicles now. We got three Cheek to Water police cars now. That's three. Hit that thumbs up extra higher for three 911 mobiles. Who do you think? You think they're gonna come out here and talk to us? Or do you think they're just gonna talk to these guys? And I don't know. Out? I think it's 50 50 at this point. I think I, if they really thought it was a problem, one of them would have already said something. I don't think the Chief Tawana Cops are gonna come out here and address us. I don't. Probably not. It's possible. I haven't had too many. Um, interactions with Chief DeWaga. Another vehicle pulling in, not a 911 vehicle. This one here doesn't say excellence matters. Hope the tyrant ain't driving that one. This guy didn't even close his door. He wants to look for a quick out. Okay, we got pulling cards calling in the uh, National Guard, now we got army uniforms and police uniforms in there, guys. And someone from an undisclosed agency. Looks like these cops are out of here. He said to keep up the good work. And we intend to. Look at this. There we go, it's the drive of honor, no unlawful directives. Dun, 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 They're coming out. Something's up. Guys, the fire are How are we doing? My name's Officer Gannon with the Chief of the Police Department. So my supervisor behind me and my other patrol officer. I talked to the hotel. Apparently they're not, they don't like you guys being on the property. Oh, we're not on their property. I understand, but they say keep no, 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 no. Yeah, it's all on video, but yeah, I got the map right here where um, we can go, where we don't go. I'm not saying you guys I say we got about a foot to the grass of the curb, but we're standing back here. Okay. We're, we're being respectful. Okay. Yep. I'm not saying you guys can't do what you're doing. You can do whatever you want to do in regards to filming, but uh, uh, the hotel is going to sign to have you guys arrest for trespass if you enter the property. That's all. Oh, yeah, that's, that's fine. No yeah. We have no intentions of coming on the property. Yep. Okay. Very well. Thank you, guys. No, thank you. Thank you, guys. Would you be able to get your name just for so we know who we advise? Uh, no, I don't wish to right, waive my fine. Fourth Amendment rights today. Okay. And that's that. I got 20 bucks if you guys know my name. <laughs> Come on, you know it. You know who you're talking to. Look at that compared to I don't even say they were bad. I, I got no gripes about the Chief Dwyer police. They, you know, they called 911, they showed up. They didn't give us any unlawful directives. They're definitely not on their property. We have no intention of stepping onto the hotel property. So. 
What's that? Talk about these old cockroach crushers, guys. Talk about the boots. They're here. Okay. Boots are staying on the public easement today. Look after these guys leave. That's about this Come on, guys, hit that thumbs up. There are 46 of you guys here. Let's get some more thumbs up on the record. Oh, sorry guys, I can't kick him out. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh no. Hey guys, thanks for checking out this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment so I can make more of these. And as always, defend your right to keep and bear cameras in public. Till next time, redress now.